This is just a short video to show you what good quality beef looks like when it goes into the pan, unlike the stuff you get in Sainsbury's. This is Waitrose or Dutch organic beef, which is all, I guess, grown within the same county I live, Cornwall. And it's fed on grass and forages from plants, I guess. Look at it. It's not sealed in a bag filled with water. It's sealed in a bag filled with air. And this means when I put it in here, it's not going to turn into condensed burgerized mush like the stuff from Sainsbury's and Co-op and Aldi does. Because the moisture content of this is already a lot less because it's in air. And yes, this is reduced packaging. This has less packaging than the other one. And it's going to be easy to break up. Look, see? It's not a big mush. It's nice and easy to break up. And the colour is amazing. You know what? There. I just had to lightly touch it. I didn't have to put any pressure on more than... Basically, a little bit more than the weight of the actual thing. This packaging, I completely believe, is as eco-friendly as the other one. And I think you make a good case for making this out of waxed paper. Because the moisture content is less, waxed paper would probably be able to deal with this. And if you ever, ever grew up in the 80s, you probably know that mince meat used to come in waxed paper, or butcher's paper, in the old days. Or greaseproof paper, as it's now called. But, but yeah. See? Nice and easy to break up and it's going to make this bolognese really nicely. And look, it goes brown instead of grey. And look, there is not a lake of water coming off of it. Can you see? The bottom of the pan is not filled with the water. The oversaturation of water in the ones in the new sealed packaging from Sainsbury's and everybody else is just horrible and I hate it. And this is why I'm going to be buying my ground beef from here because I'm totally fed up with the amount of water in the other ones. It's completely ridiculous, completely ludicrous, and I don't think anyone should have that amount of water. Look, now that it's cooking, a little bit of water's coming out, but it's not drowning it. It's not going grey, it's going a nice brown. It's going good. I like it. Right, I'm off to carry on cooking the rest of this. I'm not doing bolognese as a video again. I've done it like four times. I think we're through with that. But please stick around and watch some of my other videos. Thanks for watching and please subscribe. Bye.